what is going on guys Quicksilver here welcome back to another video this time it's been something a bit different uh, I thought I'd show you guys how to do the Easter egg on revelations I know I know I don't normally do this but you know I thought may as well because it's a nice little tutorial to give some of you guys who are more into zombies than I am and I thought I'd try to be helpful so this is how to do the keeper ritual in revelations and the easiest way I find to do it is to use the jump pad that goes to the one you want to use so that one's all red and then you can stand on it and the, the keeper will walk up to it and use it and the first step you have to do is obviously the gravestones which you can find everywhere on YouTube and what happens is a stone flies up from the grave and it will go to one of these jump pads and then you have to take your keeper there and basically protect it while it does a ritual next to the stone uh, once you find it it will be at the back of the jump pad you can see it, it's really obvious and you need to do that ritual, let, let him do that ritual for about a round to a round and a half, maybe two rounds even, and you've got to protect him. And the good thing about this is all the zombies go to him, so you can just work on protecting him. Here I think my keeper died, but once he once he finishes the ritual, what you have to do is pick up the reel that was spawn where he was standing on the jump pad. It's, it will literally be right under him or around the jump pad area. You can't, you can't really miss it uh, very difficultly. So... I hope you guys uh, found this useful, and I'll see you guys in my next tutorial and my next video. Have a good day.